everybody. I am hanging out with Beckham in her playroom. Today I leave for LA to see none other than Taylor Swift. I have been dying to go to the Eras tour and I just thought I wasn't gonna have the opportunity to and we ended up getting tickets. So I'm going. The weird part of this is Darian's yeah. also gone. He's in Wisconsin. We both plan these trips and we always check in with each other but I thought he said different dates. So now both of us are gone. So the grandmas are stepping in and taking care of B for a few days while we're gone. I'm really, really, really sad to leave her. So I'm soaking in all the time that I can with her before I leave. I still have to pack so i'm waiting on her first nap olivia is flying with me and she got here super late last night and so i think she just got up so we're gonna go get coffee before beckham's nap and then we will pack for los angeles this is one of the more chill travel days i've ever had i never take late flights but we have a four o'clock flight so we have plenty of time today and i'm basically packed i'm gonna show you guys what i have okay darian when he left this morning threw everything around but here's what i have packed this is like all the stuff that i'm bringing we're only there for a few days and everything's very compact so just need to put that in a luggage and obviously like my face wash and makeup and stuff still needs to be put in a bag but i'm gonna go grab some coffee we'll come back get ready and then we are on the way to LA. <laughs> But I don't think you understand how awful it is to get an Uber from LAX because they have you traveling across the freaking country in order to get an Uber. It's wild. Those flights felt so long. Well, we made it to the hotel room. Um, it's not really what we expected, but we're living in gratitude. We did call about 20 different hotels to try to go somewhere else. The customer service is really my number one thing that I have a problem with. First room we went into. That is James Charles. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is it? No, because when I turn the camera, it actually does look like him. Anyway, our first room that we went into smelled like weed, so I requested a second room because it was like reeked of marijuana. And our second room just is giving musty dusty. It's a nice room. That's not really the problem. It's more like the cleanliness. Like, I don't know if you guys can see this little stain that's on the mirror. I don't know what that is. We just got here. But I don't really have the authority right now in my life to get another room because all the other rooms are sold out for the Aeros tour. I'm blabbing on and what I should be doing is washing my face and going to sleep because it's 10 30 here but it's 1 30 in South Carolina where our my bodies are acclimated to. Olivia's ordering pizza but I'm gonna be asleep by that time that, that gets here. But you know what tomorrow I'm waking up and I'm getting air one and I'm getting a nice coffee and that's what's getting me through. Good night. Good morning. It's Era's tour day. My lips are still so bruised. I thought my lips were gonna be fine by now because I got them done like four days ago, but I should have known they were still gonna be bruised. So we're really gonna have to put on some liner in order to hide them. Anyway, to Air on we go. Liv was not a fan of the experience. I will say everything's super loud right now, sorry. But I will say that experience was a little different. I think everyone's here for the Eras tour, so it's super busy. And we just ran into some very rude people. There was a girl in there. I don't know if she was like an influencer or what. She was being so rude. Everyone was rude. To her I assistant. To talk to these two girls that went to the Eras tour. It's usually like if you went, you're so nice to each other and stuff. And they were like, I was like, oh, I'm going tonight. And they were like, Okay. So this girl was being evil to her assistant and I was like, girl, I don't know. It was bizarre. We're going to a bagel shop because Olivia wants a bagel and we didn't want to wait in the line. You're never taking me alive, so come close. And I know why you said it because I'm reading every word in your voice. The other girls are about to be here. I have my coffee. It's time to get ready for the... Uh, 
dress. I'm wearing a mirror ball dress. You guys are just gonna have to wait to see it if you haven't seen it on TikTok already. I think I just wanna put some like big loose curls in my hair. I'm hoping that someone gets ready early and is able to help me with that because I never do my hair first. Guys, everybody is here. We're literally not leaving for another three hours and here I am getting ready. All right, final touches on the makeup. We're not in a rush, which I was not expecting. I didn't show my full routine, but if you guys wanted to see me fully get ready, you guys can look on my TikTok. Let's get dressed. Stay. And if I could show you, I'd hope that you could see all the possibilities. There could be a place for you and me. And under the stars, you pack up your car, cause you're going. we left so i couldn't give them an update or anything but you guys i don't understand how she does that i am so amazed like she basically plays a football game every night her stage is so big i don't understand how she runs around it like that everything was just really just amazing and her facial expressions were fun her talking to the crowd was fun concerts are just weird for me sometimes because i'm like she does this every night like this is just another night for her and this is like such a big deal for us you know but i will say crazy experience she her surprise songs were you're on your own kid and death by a thousand cuts which those surprise songs are so good and i was nervous that it was going to be like a vault song or something <laughs> that we didn't know that we didn't know too well or whatever and it ended up being such good songs so i'm grateful for that <laughs> just a great experience overall highly recommend today because we have another day here we are we're about to have breakfast really and then maybe like shop look around i don't really know all i know for sure is we're going to the nice guy tonight but as far as everything else today it's just whatever we feel in the moment so y'all can stay tuned to see what we do i'm, I'm definitely missing beckham i facetimed her this morning i facetimed her every day obviously but darian's back with her and so now i get to facetime as many times as i want not that i couldn't with the grandmas but you know you don't want to be too like crazy but I will face on her probably six to seven times today. I'm ready for sure to be back with her. I miss her a lot as much fun as I'm having. It's just hard to be away from her and you know I'm, I am excited that Darian is back with her for sure. But see what today holds. ready for dinner now we kind of had a random day i feel like we just kind of walked around <laughs> did random stuff but oh it was God. fun we went to a farmer's market i asked instagram what we should do and someone said we should get scalp massages at like a asian hair place and i saw it too late because i would have loved to do that but we have reservations at eight to go to the nice guys it's one of my Shit. favorite restaurants here they have the best pasta i've ever had in my life i'm not exaggerating i'm wearing this black dress i believe it's from parade i'll show you guys fully later we have not got in and out the entire time we're here and it's one of olivia's favorite things and so we're definitely getting that tonight as an after dinner snack i will not be participating but i will be there as can't tell i feel like i've been hit by a truck i don't know if i'm sick or what but i don't 
Yo, the best. I think I'm allergic to California because I feel like every time I come back from there, this is how I feel. Beckham is down for her nap, but I've just spent all morning hanging out and loving on her. And it's been such a good day just being with her, but I just do not feel great. So I will be chug-a-lugging some lemon water and doing my best to get through the day so I can sleep for like 12 hours tonight. And yeah, California was so fun. I already gave you guys the rundown on the Aeros tour, but the rest of the time was just fun soaking up time with friends and the next time you guys see me i'll be in vegas which is in five days we did not plan that very well four days so i'm literally gonna be on the west coast in four days because we are going on a brand trip with the raiders which we did not know was happening when we planned this first trip so there's just a lot going on i'm tired i'm gonna go read and spend the rest of the day just relaxing taking it easy maybe drinking some tea Love you guys. Subscribe if you have not. A lot of you guys are not subscribed, so do that now. Love you guys. Bye.